Hey all. So I checked the rogue, uh, roguelike wiki for Doom. And I read up a little bit about the weapons and what all the uh, technical paths and bulk paths and all that do. They are used to um, assemble better weapons. So uh, I was right about that. The only thing I'm, I wasn't right about that is how you're supposed to use them. And basically what I have to do is um, I have to put like a certain, I guess, bulk packs on a weapon in a certain order to get them to uh, assemble in certain ways. So for example, if the... Um, uh, I don't have the agility mod pack anymore? Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, with those packs, anyways, if I had like two bulk packs and I throw them on like the uh, galling or the chain gun, um, I think it's possible to get like a galling gun from that. And there's, there's a bunch of other stuff I can do as well. Uh, we'll save that. That's an armor shard that it repairs armor. Whoa! I'm using the wrong weapon. Ow. I'll be careful here. Not enough room, so okay. I'll be careful around those barrels. There's a guy over there, because I saw a door open. There is what I want. We got a couple lost souls over here. There's demons in there. Imps, chain gunner. Interesting mix of guys to fight, right? Uh, let's kill him. That's a double shotgun. All right, we want to um, unload. Not you. Unload this shotgun. Drop a. Pick up the double shotgun. Okay, kill this guy. Whoops. So now I've got myself a regular uh, double shotgun if I need it. Let's see here. I want to quick swap weapon. How do I do that again? This is the problem of, ha of having all these keys for it. Um, I really only played Knee Deep in the Dead, so I never actually got up to the double shotgun. Okay, so it's five I need for the double shotgun. So, five to prepare a double shotgun. We reload it. Um, double shotgun is now B. And I think it's six for a chain gun. I should hit him. He's dead. He's dead. There's some red armor here. And a rocket launcher right here. Unload this. Oops. Unload the rocket launcher. There's a homing phasing device here. And a technical mod pack right here. I apparently already have a technical mod pack, but um, more than, you know, never bad. I'm probably not gonna learn too much about uh, how, how to assemble weapons this, uh, you know, for a little bit, but I'll get there sooner or later. Uh, let's drop off some ammo. You know what, we're going to drop off some of the uh, med packs too. They're important to have and not that important to keep around, right? Let's drop those off. Let's see here, so home phase device. This upgrades phase, uh, upgrade phase device will definitely save your skin. I assume that makes me invisible for a little bit. Uh, let's use the technical mod packs on stuff, I guess. But actually, no, we don't have to. Or yes, we do. 
I think uh, what I could do with them is if I equip the rocket launcher and if I use the technical mod packs on it so I now got a technical mod pack on the rocket launcher one and let's see if I can do this if I do it again on the weapon um, special assembly possible do you want to assemble the micro launcher yes so there's one of the one of the um, assemblies I could do there's the micro launcher micro launcher so now if I look at my weapon and all that the rocket launcher is the most standard way of blowing things up so there's the micro launcher uh, it's got accuracy 7, explosion rate 3, rocket jump whoa let's see here, here's the regular rocket launcher if I look at this one and this the other one uh, Basically, you can see that the micro launcher has a much faster reload time and firing time. It has better accuracy, but it comes at a cost of explosion radius. So, you know, those will fix a couple of the problems I had last time with the, with the uh, lock, rocket launcher. So, there's a there's an upgrade basically for it. Let's um, take off our blue armor. Drop this armor. So there's some blue armor. Here's some red armor. Red armor protects me from fire. Fire resistance. It comes at a cost of move speed, but you know, whatever. Nice red and shiny look out for it because if it's gone, you're gone too. We'll put that on because there's imps on this level. And I'll keep you around too. And we'll start firing in this direction. I didn't hit anyone there, Sally. I was probably too far away to hit him, so let's just get closer. That killed him. And... That worked quite well. It's hard to see this far out, but he's probably moved far too far away, so there he is. The only bad thing about uh, having to, you know, reset text is I have to reset text. There's an environmental soup over here. And a plasma rifle. So the plasma rifle, I think, is pretty much just like the um, plasma gun from last time in the you know, original Doom. Basically, it's a chain fire weapon. And a plasma rifle shoots multiple rounds of plasma energy, frying some demon butt. And it should use the um, power cells down here to use to fire it off. Now we're gonna use this guy down here. Tracking map. If I was not a technical class guy, I could you know track where everything is. Let's hit this barrel. That's fun. So we made, you know, destruction everywhere. That possibly destroys stuff, I think.
Is there anything over here? There's some acid in there. Use you. We'll get you. Get you. And I'll just explore down here. All this stuff should be an int that over there, so let's see what this environment suit does. So if I pick it up, it's not you know uh, instant usable type thing. Playing on a lava bath, you'll definitely need this. I assume that means that it will let me uh, walk through lava. <clears throat> I feel relatively safe. Get you. Get you. And I assume we're probably good to go. The stairs all the way over on your side. The boots feel like new, so you can actually up, 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 um, repair your boots with these too. I didn't know that. Steel boots are now 100%. That will give me, you know, I guess a little bit more armor. I'm not sure if the armor really helps you, um, ar if armor helps you at all from, you know, possibly having like a steel boots on, or if it's just, you know, you wear steel boots and you only get knockback resistance, or you wear the red armor and you only get the fire resistance. I'm gonna afford to pick up some more ammo. Yeah, we're good for ammo. I got the ammo chain down there too, right? So. And. Phobia 7. You don't have the room for the bulk pack? I want that bulk pack for sure. Um. Yeah, let's use the phasing device. You feel yanked in the non zectial direction? I wonder if that's a teleporter, if that's what it's all about. That could be interesting, I guess, the phase device. Let's get the bulk pack, I'll need it for later. It's not for my backpack, so I'm at 100, you know, 100 ammo. Let's get the steel boots. No, I won't get the steel boots, there's, oh! Oh, that hurt. At least I was, I was in the red armor, so. I didn't take much damage from it. There's a combat shot done here. Let's drop the blue armor. So the combat shotgun is uh, another shotgun type. How it works compared to say the double shotgun or the uh, regular shotgun is that you have to pump it each time he fires, and it's got five, um, five uh, you know things that you can shoot with it. For, uh, five ammunition um, installed. You also have to reload it one at a time, so it's kind of slow, but the common shotgun is pretty powerful. It's not a bad weapon if I was going to use common shotguns, or, you know, shotguns in general. Cool, I leveled. I'm a juggler now. So with this, whenever I release something, I should be able to walk right up to her, their, their, um, right up to them. And I'm basically going to hit him with a chainsaw. It was in my alternate. I actually missed him a few times there. over here I saw you I killed him I'll use you get the ammo
He's dead. I heard a lost soul somewhere. Sounds play a pretty big, uh, pretty big role in Doom RL. Someone actually complained about the, you know, the use of sounds, but sounds actually do improve the game quite a bit. And it's not like you have to, you know, listen to them to play the game. Yay, relatively safe. Hey, look at that, there's some armor over there. An onyx armor. This looks like, uh, looks absurdly resistant. I assume that means that it's resistant to a lot of stuff. So if I put it on, it gives me no particular resistance, but I guess um, putting it on will have the effect. I wonder if I can wear the environmental suit. Well, let's see if I can do that. We're going to go environmental suit. You feel protected. So this thing's uh, like a, um, it's like, Mike, just like in a regular Doom, it's a usable item. But you can carry it around in this one. Let's see here. I'll put back on the red armor. Uh, we'll see. We'll leave the, cl the globe there for now. Let's just look around the rest of the map. Do 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 do. We. You can't move very fast when you want to in Doom. I don't see anything over here of much use, so. If I want to, there's an environmental suit. I guess I'll pick them up. There are, there are instances where you may want to have the environmental suit, I guess. Drop. Nothing. We're going to keep going. There is this. And then we want to go this way, pick you up on the way. And what is this one called? This is Phobius Lab. I think this was a secret level for the original, um, what do you call it? Doom, the secret level for Doom. And look at that, there's a use for the environmental soup right now. Let's see how it works. So if I step in the um, acid, it will hurt me, you know, to step in it, but if I put on this environmental suit... No trouble. I can step on the acid all I want. Won't hurt me. I don't think. Whoops. Oh shoot, that's a lot of demons. Let's uh, run across the lava. They'll actually get hurt running through lava. Works quite well. That's what you're after. Um, so much like in the original Foa's lab, um, you need to, I guess, extend that to get to the secret level or whatever. Oh, I ran out of environmental suit. There's another large med pack if I need it. Actually, I do want that for future use. Something I know is that you can close doors. I haven't been doing so, um, but if I want to, I can go in here and say, close those doors so nothing can get through them. All right, so we can't go in there just yet. This is very reminiscent of what you have to do in, I guess, the original Doom, so it's this way first. 
you. And then we hit the switch. Green access granted, west door is unlocked. So if I go this way. We'll find these doors over here unlocked. Oh shoot, right there on top of me. Um, controls, I want to put on a double shotgun, which is five, just to verify. I don't want to make mess up here. Do this and, oh, I can prepare it instantly because you know, that's what I am now. I am a juggler. Boom, boom. So there's a couple of demons I had to go through. Uh, better take as much ammo as possible. What else is around? What's that roar? Ooh, spooky music. This is definitely one of the better done levels. Ah, there we go, environmental suits to take me back and forth. And piss ammo. Let's drop what for these things? We'll drop a small med pack and I'll use it to pick up you. Drop ammo and I use it to pick up you. I'm actually gonna drop one of the shotgun shells. I got so many of them. And we will use up the environmental suit and go this way. I bet there's imps over here. Green armor right there. Health globe. Green armor again. If I hit this switch, blue access granted. The wall is lowered. You feel less protected. Um, I need to use the environmental suit a little bit more. We're going to run back a little bit more. And the whole purpose of doing this is so that these guys get on the um, lava a little bit more. Uh, I need to throw a shotgun now. Let's fire at you guys. Red damage is damaged. Red armor is damaged. I know he's up there. The wall is lowered. Yep, that happens in the original one too. Then he gets stopped, right? And I got stopped. Uh, let's use this. Pick up some ammo. Pick up way too much ammo. Pick up this. You know what? We probably don't need to have all these small med packs. So we'll drop one. That'll leave a little bit more. Walls lowered again. These guys are easier to deal with. Um, this lab won't do any more experience. I wonder if um, there are others. So that probably means that there's nothing else left. And of course over here we've got the pathway over here. Power mod, agility mod, that's all nice. I'll have to look at what those can be assembled into. But we'll keep them now, the agility mod, the bulk, bulk, bulk mod pack and the other thing. There's some more armor over here. And our comet shotgun. 
I assume that this over here is probably a secret of some sort. So this is gonna hurt, but I'm gonna actually gonna go acid out. I'm gonna try and explore over here to see what's on the other side over here. Ow, 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 ow. The steel boots are completely destroyed, so my steel boots are destroyed from walking the acid. Let's use med pack. Large. I'm exploring basically, this is why I'm here, right? So. Don't do this if you don't have to. There's nothing there. Oh, I got a bunch of uh, med packs again. Probably should have picked up a green armor, but whatever. I'll pick up a little bit of ammo on the way out. Don't have enough room for that. I thought that was a super health glow, but it isn't. There's actually a large med pack up there I'm going to pick up before I leave, I guess. We. So, unlike the regular Doom, you actually do have limited space for, you know, picking up lots and lots of stuff. Um. Actually, you know what? Simple thing I can do. Just use a thing there. Full health. I'll keep the small med pack for future use. So there's my character at the point at this point. I'll pick up you. We'll drop uh Maybe I should put on the Onyx armor now. But no, I do actually want to keep the blue armor because I'm getting close to the um, the end boss for what was knee deep in the dead, the first episode of Doom. So I want to let's drop the um, we'll drop the uh, red armor, I guess. I'll pick you up. I'll put on the uh, I can't put on the blue armor apparently. It's not in my backpack. That's why. Put this on. So there we go, I got myself um, some blue armor on now, that'll help me against plasma resistance, we're going to need it for the boss. Uh, the next level should be kind of difficult, so I think we'll stop it here. I'm going to show you this uh, time this time around what you used to do to save, you basically press S and it says game saved, press enter to exit, and then this brings you here, that's all they do when you know, like saving it. You also get this nice little continue game screen when you come back. So we'll have to see how my guy continues. I'll have to look and see what I can do with the, um... Whoopsie. So, blah, blah, you arrive in focus and obviously you sense a certain tension. There's red armor lying here. Very good. So if I need to, there's red armor here. You didn't know. So this uh, should be the end boss. I want to check out to see what power mod, agility mod, and bulk mod might be able to upgrade. If I can upgrade anything I currently have, then I will. And we'll have, you know, Another assembly out of the way. If I look at the assemblies now, you'll see that micro launcher. To get a micro launcher, all I need is two techno packs. So that's all it says for it. So I hope you enjoy it so far. We'll see what I can do. Alright, so since I can't save unless I'm on stairs, we're going to have to continue. I looked up the wiki while I was out though, so let's just do this. Um, if you have. Um, a power mod pack and a agility mod pack and use them on your armor. So I use this thing and we're gonna modify armor. So blue armor now has A on it. And if I use this again, I think with the power mod pack. So if I use R and we modify armor, this time can't be modified. I guess I did it wrong. So I guess you have to do this in a, in a certain, um, a certain uh, sort of, uh, way of modding stuff, you have to go a certain, um, you have to use like the power mod pack first and then you have to use the other one after it. So I messed up there. Okay, well that's kind of sucks.
Can't use the, um, you can't modify the armor. Oh well, that's okay. Well, I still got the other stuff to use up. I'm not really a fan of this part, but we're gonna get our asses kicked. The walls are gonna come down in a moment. I'm gonna have to fight a bunch of lost souls. And there we go. The sun of the walls lower. Does lost soul hit you? Okay, I want to fire in this direction. And. Oh, I might die here. Let's use the large med pack. I'm good at, it's great that I use it instantly because I'd probably die here if I didn't. Uh, since I have the ability to um, quick juggle weapons, we're going to get the rocket launcher. And I want to do an alternate fire with a capital F, so we're going to Well, that sort of hurt me, but I knocked him away, right? So, I'm not completely screwed over. Get this out. And then we'll get this out. It's hitting me. I survive! Hooray! That's how you survive that. Rocket jump. And I'll pick these bad boys up. My blue armor nearly got destroyed from that. I hope that agility mod helped keep me alive. You know what? We're going to drop the uh, blue armor because, you know, if it's not going to help me as much anymore, uh, we won't keep it, basically. Just in case, um, I can't use the bulk mod on anything, right? So, can't use on the weapon. This time can't be modified. I uh, can't put on the blue armor and say, "Hey, can I use the bulk mod on you?" Can't be modified. Okay, so I'm, I'm pretty sure I can't do anything with the uh, power mod and the bulk mod on the armor, sadly. So yeah, we'll drop the um, the armor. And we'll run around with this stuff over here. And I'll have to make sure I get it right next time with uh, the other stuff. I should probably use up the... Uh, that stuff. Alright, so this room's clear. Now we're going to get to difficult stuff. You should know what this part is all about. The sign of the wall disappears. So you should probably know who those two are. This is the uh, reminiscent of the old knee deep in the dead bosses. Okay, he's running too fast for me to keep away from. Uh, we actually want to run away from these guys, I think. At least they can they can knock me away. That's good. Ow, probably should reload it there. Fire this way. And let's hope that these guys are going to get killed if I keep going like this. Oh, that hurt. That was not a good idea. I may die here. I hear a free skull. Hey, I won. Killed them both. 
So I get WizKit, by the way, you can uh, get the better stuff you can modify up to. That should be noted, but I'm not going to get it now because I don't really care about it. I'm not, you know, trying to... Well, I suppose it will give me more uh, options to do, so let's do that. WizKid 1. Um, why do they have to come in pairs? What's that shimmering thing? So we killed both of those guys, I think. There's one corpse. Don't know where the other one is. Don't really care. There's the little, you know, things. Pick up some rockets because you know I'd use them. You feel yanked in a non existing direction. Alright, so once you beat the big get badasses and clean out the moon base, you're supposed to win, aren't you? Aren't you? Where's your fat reward and take it back home? What the hell is this? It's not supposed to end this way. It stinks like rotten meat, but it looks like lost Daniel's base. Looks like you're stuck on the shores of hell. And the only way out is through hell. Alright, time to start picking up some, you know, health packs and such. Uh, what did I just pick up? You picked up a large med pack. Where is it then? Oh, it's right there. Hey, it's right in front of me and I'm not seeing it. So we're in hell. And here we've got ourselves the Hell Knight. Let's switch to this. Oh, it tore into me. I'm getting my ass kicked by my own self and everything else is close. Get this now. Ow. This is not a good idea, going past the barrel. I got two ammo chains now, that's pretty cool. Lots and lots of stuff around. Um, I think another thing I could get was with this. Let's see if I can do this right. So if I use the um, combat knife, that should be one. And if I go power mod pack on weapon, and then if I go bulk mod pack on weapon, special assembly possible. Do you want to assemble the chainsword? Yes. So you should know what this thing is. The chainsaw is basically uh, reminiscent of the um, Warhammer um, Marine type of uh, weapon. Uh, let's see here, I'll take it off. So there's the chainsaw. It does 8 D2. Not what you really like to use, but it's better than your fists. So there's 8 D2, and if I look at the chainsaw, that's 5 D6. So. I probably want to use the chainsaw still, but you know, there's just a thing I can do if I ever want to. There's the chainsaw. We'll drop that. I don't need it. I just want to show it off. I still want to show it off, right? Chainsaw. Combat shotgun's right there. We'll unload the shotgun shells. Ammo should get a little bit more scarce now, so I want to be a little bit more careful of that. Where are some more guys to kill? Oh god, they're everywhere! Got him. Got him. Unload this. Pick that up. Unload this, get that. Would you believe this is only my second run in Doom? Um, is the Onyx Armor not uh, capable of losing durability? That'd be cool. 
I guess it doesn't lo uh, lose durability, the um, Ox armor. That's good to know. It just stays intact. We. Where are you, little things to kill? I want to kill, kill, kill. Nope. Eh, I can use some more ammo. Pretty sure there's some more ammo somewhere over here. This is our comet knife. I still have what packs on hand? Nothing. So I've used up all my packs at this point. I feel relatively safe, I'm happy about that. There's the little down if I want to. We'll explore around first. There's nothing this way. We. Ah, uh, I don't need that many shotgun shells. And what's this special level over here? This is Deimos Lab. Well, this is probably going to be running as a Phobos Lab. I'm probably going to kill here because I've never done this one before. I have nothing, no idea what to expect. So, here we go. So, let's see here. I'll see you guys in the next um, episode of Doom RL, and we'll see how far I get with this game.